Hi, welcome to Professional Certifications Channel. Let's break down RHI exam, one topic a day for focused and effective learning. Today's topic is Electronic Medical Records, EMR, in healthcare. 1. What is an Electronic Medical Record, EMR? Let's begin with the basics what exactly is an Electronic Medical Record, or EMR. An EMR is a digital version of a patient's paper chart that is used within a single healthcare organization. It contains the patient's medical history, diagnoses, treatment plans, medications, and lab results, but it's primarily designed to be used by healthcare providers within one practice or hospital system. EMRs are a valuable tool for streamlining record-keeping and improving the efficiency of care. However, unlike electronic health records, EHRs, which are designed for sharing data between different providers and organizations, EMRs typically stay within the boundaries of the healthcare facility where they were created. 2. Key Components of an EMR An EMR is a comprehensive system that captures a wide range of patient information. Let's break down the key components of an EMR and how they contribute to better healthcare delivery. 1. Patient Demographics and Identification Every EMR contains basic information about the patient, such as name, date of birth, address, and insurance details. This helps providers quickly access the correct patient record and ensures accurate identification during treatment. 2. Medical History EMRs store detailed information about the patient's past medical history, including chronic conditions, previous surgeries, allergies, and immunizations. This is critical for providers to understand the patient's health background and make informed decisions about care. 3. Medications and Prescriptions EMRs include current and past medications prescribed to the patient, along with dosage and frequency. This helps providers track treatments, avoid prescription errors, and monitor the patient's progress on their medications. 4. Lab and Diagnostic Test Results Lab results and diagnostic imaging reports are stored in the EMR, allowing providers to quickly review results without waiting for paper reports. This speeds up the decision-making process and helps providers make timely treatment adjustments. 5. Treatment Plans and Progress Notes Providers use EMRs to document treatment plans, patient visits, and progress notes. This helps maintain continuity of care and allows other members of the care team to stay updated on the patient's current status and future treatment needs. 6. Clinical Alerts and Reminders EMRs often include built-in clinical decision support tools, such as alerts and reminders, that can notify providers about potential drug interactions, overdue screenings, or recommended immunizations. This ensures that patients receive preventive care and reduces the risk of errors. 3. Benefits of EMRs in Healthcare The introduction of EMRs has had a significant positive impact on healthcare organizations and patient care. Let's look at some of the key benefits of EMRs. 1. Improved Record Keeping and Organization EMRs streamline the process of keeping patient records, reducing the need for paper charts and manual filing systems. This allows healthcare providers to quickly retrieve patient information and ensures that records are organized and complete. 2. Increased efficiency and workflow automation. EMRs automate many routine tasks, such as medication ordering, test result retrieval, and appointment scheduling. This reduces the administrative burden on healthcare providers and allows them to spend more time focused on patient care. 3. Better communication within a practice. One of the key strengths of EMRs is that they improve communication between healthcare providers within the same practice or hospital. With access to a patient's complete medical record, doctors, nurses, and specialists can collaborate more effectively and ensure that care is coordinated. 4. Reduced medical errors. EMRs help reduce medical errors by providing real-time access to patient data, flagging potential drug interactions, and ensuring that providers have the most up-to-date information about the patient's health. This improves patient safety and helps providers avoid mistakes. 5. Enhanced patient care and outcomes. By providing healthcare providers with a more comprehensive view of the patient's health, EMRs allow for better decision-making and more personalized care. 
The availability of detailed medical histories, lab results, and medication records ensures that providers can make more informed decisions and deliver better care. 4. Challenges and Limitations of EMRs While EMRs offer numerous benefits, they also come with certain challenges and limitations that healthcare organizations need to address. Let's explore some of these challenges. 1. Limited Data Sharing One of the biggest limitations of EMRs is that they are primarily designed for use within a single organization, making it difficult to share data with external healthcare providers. This can create barriers to care coordination, especially for patients who see multiple providers across different organizations. 2. Cost of Implementation The initial cost of implementing an EMR system can be high, especially for smaller healthcare practices. The expenses include software licensing, hardware, training, and ongoing maintenance. While the long-term benefits often outweigh the costs, the upfront investment can be a significant barrier for some organizations. 3. Learning Curve for Providers Adopting an EMR system requires training for healthcare providers and staff, which can take time and effort. Some providers may find it difficult to transition from paper records to electronic systems, especially if the EMR interface is not user-friendly. 4. Data Entry Burden Some healthcare providers find that EMRs increase the amount of time they spend entering data, especially during patient visits. This can take time away from direct patient care and lead to frustration for providers. Optimizing workflows and using tools like voice recognition can help reduce this burden. 5. Security and Privacy Concerns with the digitization of patient data, EMRs also introduce security risks, such as data breaches and unauthorized access. Healthcare organizations must implement strong cybersecurity measures to protect patient data, including encryption, access controls, and regular audits. 5. Best Practices for Implementing and Using EMRs To maximize the benefits of EMRs while addressing the challenges, Healthcare organizations should follow best practices for implementation and use. Let's look at some strategies for success. 1. Choose the right EMR system for your organization. When selecting an EMR system, it's important to choose one that fits the needs of your practice or hospital. Consider factors such as ease of use, customization options, integration with other systems, and vendor support. Involving healthcare providers in the decision-making process ensures that the system chosen aligns with clinical workflows. 2. Provide comprehensive training. Training is essential for the successful implementation of an EMR system. Make sure that all healthcare providers and staff are thoroughly trained on how to use the EMR effectively. Ongoing training and support will help ensure that users remain comfortable with the system and can make full use of its features. 3. Optimize workflows. EMRs should be integrated into clinical workflows in a way that minimizes disruptions. Streamline data entry processes and take advantage of tools like templates, voice recognition, and decision support features to reduce the time spent on documentation. This helps improve efficiency and ensures that EMRs enhance rather than hinder patient care. 4. Implement strong security measures to protect patient data it's critical to implement strong security measures for your EMR system. This includes using encryption, access controls, secure logins, and regular security audits. Make sure that all staff members are trained on the importance of data security and the best practices for protecting patient information. 5. Ensure data backup and recovery. Regularly backup your EMR data to prevent data loss in the event of a system failure or cyber attack. Having a robust data backup and recovery plan in place ensures that patient records remain accessible and secure, even in the case of unexpected disruptions. 6. Monitor and evaluate EMR use. Continuously monitor how the EMR system is being used within your organization and gather feedback from healthcare providers. Regularly assess whether the EMR is improving patient care, provider satisfaction, and operational efficiency. Use this feedback to make improvements and optimize the system. Conclusion In conclusion, electronic medical records, EMRs, have become an essential tool in modern healthcare, improving record-keeping, enhancing patient care, 
and increasing efficiency within healthcare organizations. By implementing EMRs effectively and addressing the challenges they present, healthcare providers can maximize their benefits and deliver high quality care. Whether you're a healthcare provider, administrator, or health information professional, understanding how to use EMRs effectively is key to improving healthcare delivery.